Hi, it's David here from Starship, and welcome back to another product update. As we head into the busy part of the year, our team has been hard at work on features and enhancements to help you get the most out of Starship in preparation for that busy peak season. Let's dive into it. The first update on our list is machine learning transit times. You can now view estimated transit times for your different carrier products directly in the Starship dashboard. Here's how it works. We've harnessed the power of machine learning and paired that with our pool of historical delivery data to bring you estimated transit times based on where you're sending to and from. Next up, we're making a change to how we provide SMS services within Starship. Now, you can enter your own SMS accounts directly with Starship. So what does this change mean for you? Well, you get better SMS rates, up to around 50% cheaper, and you gain access to built-in account top-up features like auto recharge. You also get the same billing account across multiple Starship instances, and you get more visibility into your SMS sending. Next up, we've got some new rules that'll be sure to enhance your shipping process. Let's take a look. Some rules based on item quantity, including total item quantity and item quantity. These rules give you greater flexibility and precision in managing how orders are processed. We've also got a new rule to help you select the most cost-effective carrier. This rule lets you choose the cheapest carrier option between predefined carriers and services. Without this rule, selecting the cheapest carrier might default to standard post options, which aren't suitable in some circumstances. But by specifying the carriers for comparison, you ensure that you're not only getting the best price, but also meeting your delivery speed requirements. Next up, you can now filter the orders group to display only orders containing single SKUs. This makes it really easy when you're trying to process orders all containing the same SKU. Here at Starship It, our team is always working hard on a list of integrated carriers to make sure you get the best experience when using the carriers that you need for your business. This month, we've been hard at work on FedEx, and here are some of the updates. You can now add your order number onto FedEx labels. You can also populate your item descriptions on commercial invoices with more information for international shipments. You can also now add a declaration statement to your FedEx commercial invoice and set a default drop-off type for your FedEx shipments. Check out the link in the video description for the full list of changes with FedEx. Finally, we're pleased to announce support for Allied Express and the fact that our Sendor integration now supports domestic shipping within the US and Canada. And that's a wrap on this month's Starship It video product update. Head over to the blog linked in our video description to get the full list of changes. And top tip, you can now subscribe to our change log directly to get notified of all new releases as they come out. Happy shipping!